yesterday. A day which the Dodgers have got to get off the back foot and take whatever they can get. Tom, it might be appropriate right along here in the first inning to discuss the fog ball, the way Gullet throws it, how hard he throws it, what the action is. Ball two. Well, opening up game number one over in, in Yankee Stadium, I was calling his, his uh, fork ball a curveball. It's very, it was difficult for me to tell up here, and then I talked to him afterwards about his curveball. He says, I didn't throw a curveball. Those were all fork balls. He's got a darn good one, and the action, that, that's his fastball, but the action will look like a curveball. From up here, it looks like a curveball. Davey Lopes, in his last two games, has started the ball game with a walk and then stolen second base. And now he is 3-0 with Don Gullen. There's a strike. Do you remember in game one, Gullen got off with control problems in the first inning as well? He often does that. The time to get Gullet, if you're going to get him, is early. Ball is hit well to left. Panella going to the corner, going to the corner, going back. Can't get it. Going for three. Rubis comes across to help. A throw at third base. Triple. That ball carried on Canella. He didn't think it was going as far as he did. We told you yesterday about the way the ball jumps out of here in the daytime. What? It hit absolutely at the very tippy top of the gate. He could have had the bullpen. He had a miracle yesterday. Couldn't quite get to that one. But he hit did. the rail at the top of that gate. Uh, that must have missed a home run probably by two.